हाई एवरी वन जय हिंद जय भारत जय माता दी इफ यू वॉन्ट टू जॉइन मर्चेंट नेवी आफ्टर क्लास ट्वेल्थ लुकिंग फॉर आर ऑप्शन मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट यू वॉन्ट टू डू बी टेक मरीन इंजीनियरिंग देन एम ई आर आई कोलकाता कैन बी योर चॉइस लेट सी वाई फर्स्ट थिंग कोर्सेज आफ्टर आफ्टर क्लास ट्वेल्थ बी टेक मरीन इंजीनियरिंग कंपनीज लाइक शेवरॉन डॉक एंड डोल बर्नाल शुल्टे मैनेजमेंट फ्लीट मैनेजमेंट एन वाई के एंग्लोशन मेनी मोर आर कमिंग आगे बढ़ते हैं एज क्राइटेरिया मिनिमम इज 17 इयर्स मैक्सिमम फॉर मेल जनरल इज 25 फाइव ईयर्स ओ बी सी ट्वेंटी एट ईयर्स एस सी एस सी थर्टी ईयर्स फॉर फीमेल यू हैव गॉट अ रिलेक्शन ऑफ टू ईयर्स फर्दर दैट इज फॉर जनरल ट्वेंटी सेवन ईयर्स ओ बी सी थर्टी ईयर्स एंड एस सी एस सी थर्टी टू ईयर्स ऑलवेज रिमेंबर दैट द रेफरेंस डेट फॉर कैलकुलेशन ऑफ द एज विल बी फ्रॉम द डेट ऑफ कमेंसमेंट ऑफ अकेडमिक सेशन आई रिपीट वन सेकेंड वॉट डज दैट मीन से योर आई एम सूट एग्जाम इज इन जून इट डज नॉट मैटर बट योर अकेडमिक सेशन इन द कॉलेज स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम फर्स्ट ऑगस्ट ट्वेंटी so that means you should not be less than 17 years on 1st august 2023 or you should not be more than 25 years in general category for male on 1st august 2023 so you can apply as per age educational qualification in 10 plus 2 with pcm you should have a minimum 60% aggregate in english you should have either should not be having less than 50% in the 10th or 12th if you want to join later entry that means suppose you have done a 3 year diploma course from a aict approved college in mechanical electrical electronics engineering and in your final year of your diploma you have got minimum 55% marks you can straight away apply clear your imct with a good rank and go to btech marine engineering for mri -E kolkata straight away in the second year copy it guys if you are from scst categories there is a 5% relaxation in pcm aggregate marks however it will not apply for english marks so if you have got Uh, 58, 57 marks in PCM. Then yes, you can still go for MERI Kolkata after clearing IMUCT. But most important thing, once you clear IMUCT, because you have got less than 60 percent in PCM, you will also have once you go on your first ship as junior engineer, you come back, you give your MEO class for exam. Your other batchmates who had more than 60 percent marks over there, they'll give MEO class for Part B exam, which has six written and four orals. But if you have got less than 60 percent marks, you will have to give. एम ई ओ क्लास फोर पार्ट ए एज वेल अलग और भी एग्जाम देने पड़ेंगे टोटल नंबर ऑफ सिक्स टू एटी सिक्स फिजिकल मेडिकल स्टैंडर्ड आर शुड बी फिजिकली फिट फॉर सी सर्विस आई साइड शुड बी सिक्स बाय ट्वेल्व इन बोथ आईज और इफ इन वर्स केस अगर एक आई में सिक्स बाय एटीन है दे अदर आई शुड बी सिक्स बाय नाइन कॉपेट गाइज नो कलर ब्लाइंडनेस ओपन बोर्ड स्टूडेंट्स एंड इंप्रूवमेंट कैंडिडेट्स फ्रॉम द सेम बोर्ड कैन अप्लाई एम ई आर आई कोलकाता में फीस फॉर द बी टेक मरीन इंजीनियरिंग फोर ईयर कोर्स ऑफ बॉयज इज नाइन लाख रुपीज फॉर बी टेक मरीन इंजीनियरिंग फॉर गर्ल्स फीस इज फाइव लैख सेवेंटी टू थाउजेंड रुपीज हाउ टू अपलाई अपलाई फॉर आई एम सी टी एग्जाम वन द रिजल्ट आर आउट आउट अपलाई फॉर ऑनलाइन काउंसिलिंग फॉर आई एम यू कैंपस इज गो देयर जय माता दी नाउ हाउ टू अपलाई फेज वन ऑल द सिलेक्टेड कैंडिडेट्स हुए बिन इशूड विद द आई एम यू सी टी रैंक सर्टिफिकेट विल बी प्रोवाइडेड विद द पोर्टल थ्रू विच दे कैन सिलेक्ट द प्रोग्राम एंड कैंपस वेयर दे वॉन्ट टू टेक एडमिशन So there will be a lot of colleges. I am in Kolkata campus. I am in Mumbai campus. I am in Chennai campus. So you need to select the college and the course which you want. You will have to pay a ten thousand rupees fees as a counselling fee. If the seat is not allocated to you, say there is no seat available over there and all the seats are filled, then in that case nine thousand rupees will be refunded. But if they have allocated you a seat, say they allocate you a seat in I M R I Kolkata, and due to some reason you don't want to join later on, then in that case your ten thousand rupees are gone. phase 2 based on your rank say in the first phase of counseling you were not getting admission anywhere bhai tumhe call hi nahi kiya pata tha ki mri kolkata will get filled up in 3000 seats only so you were not called in phase 2 and you were left in waiting period say waiting period 5 waiting list 7 8 something like that so in phase 2 now maybe some students did not join mri kolkata or mri mumbai now in that case the college is going to call you based on your rank say in the merit list where you are in the waiting list on your social category whether that seat list is for general category or scst category and availability of the seat so you have given your availability that i want to do btech marine engineering from mri kolkata so if in mri kolkata there is a vacant seat and you come in the merit list then they will call you and in that case you can get a seat so never lose hope for mri kolkata campuses you can always get if not in phase 1 then in phase few, phase 2 on one of the cases i just heard i do not know how true it is That was student said that he had a rank of five thousand one hundred something last attempt in IIM CT and still in the phase two he was getting MRI Kolkata seat. So sometimes luck does play its role. Once the seat is allotted, candidates have to pay the program fee of rupees twenty five thousand. 
to confirm the seat remember that this payment will also be non refundable jai mata di so there has been time where students keep asking me sir should i join this college how much is the placement criteria how much is the placement criteria how much is the waiting period and these things keep changing so i thought what to do and that is where the idea of starting something like google reviews on our own website merchant navy decoded came into my mind and that is how on my website called merchantnavydecoded.com i started a thing called college portal so like when you have to book a uh, when you have to book a hotel you go for google reviews now if you want to go for uh, college you can see what are the reviews how is the standard so let us see how you have, you can do so you click on the college portal now suppose you are a gme aspirant so you will click over here you are a etu aspirant you will click over here you are a iim ct or dns aspirant you will click over here you are a gp rating aspirant it will come over here you are an aspirant for btech marine engineering then also there will be an option option over here and for any other course that comes with the time it will be there so right now say you come to this course and you are interested in say iim ct and dns and you want to know about anglo right so what you do is you click over on iim ct and dns anglo and then suddenly you will see the highly recommended colleges from merchant navy decoded over here for dns so for highly recommended you will see anglo station maybe over here or it will be in the other college section it depends whether ama is good or not but we'll recommend ama for sure as of now then you will click over here on ama so when you will click you will see overview section then you can click you can see all about overview then you can see the eligibility criteria then the fee structure registration process syllabus kaisa hai how is the placement recorded over here copy it in ama everything you will come to know copy it then this is the say you you click on the placement scenario you get to see the placement scenario of ama over here but the most important thing is how students perceive this college those who have studied over here so now you can come over and see the rating how good is anglo in case of placement how good is am am in case of waiting period how good is training and well being of am over here when you watch these ratings over here that is where you learn that is where you understand what are the right questions you need to ask and should you get into am or you should avoid getting into am so this is one thing apart from that it is a request if you know someone who has passed out from ama for a particular course tell them bhai whatever your review is just go and share on this college portal and yes don't be scared if you have something bad to share about any college any course just do that and post that review anonymously over here just posting it as no ki don't show my name post it as anonymously yes and your name will not come over and that is how this college portal is not going to just help you but every other person who is joining merchant navy thank you very much jai hind jai bharat jai mata